just absolutely delighted to be here. My name is Beverly Daniels Greenberg, and this is my first juried show. And the name of the piece is All the News That's Fit to Paint. And what I did was I folded newspaper and I put acrylic paint on it. Uh, so that's the piece, and I was just delighted that the jurors selected my piece. I'm a retired judge in Alameda County, and I retired about four years ago, and my new passion is art. Well, my friends have been encouraging me to, to do it, and so one of my friends in Emeryville, because my studio is here in Emeryville, suggested that I do it, and I said, sure, uh, and that's why I did it. So what do you think about the celebration of the art? I think it's wonderful. I've been attending now for probably the last four or five years, or even longer, on and off over the years. And I think they do a wonderful thing. And there's so many gifted artists here in Emeryville, and I'm just delighted, just delighted to join the community, to be a part of the community. My name is B. Finger. This is my favorite piece. Because a woman that has to work is evidently taking great pleasure in it. She's selling, she's selling grapes. That's enough. And so, what was your inspiration? My inspiration? Well, I was doing a series of women at work. And this is definitely work. She got to pick the grapes and then sell them and weigh that with the primitive scale. How long did it take you to paint that particular piece? Oh, maybe three, three, three sessions. And how long is each session? Oh, I don't know. I uh, go into the art room where we live. And uh, I sit down and I do it until I encroach on myself. Wow. Uh, well, I mean, when I, I, I start to move. But I like her. She's not beautiful. She's not stylish. And she's doing a job. The detail is amazing. Well, once I get started, that's what happens. So you just, just, it just leads you just to yeah. go, go, go? Yeah, but see, she's, uh, she feels that she has accomplished something, and I feel that way, too, you know. So what do you think about the celebration, Emeryville Celebration of the Arts? Oh, I think it's great. I think, and this is the first time for me. And I better do everything quick, I'm getting old. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay. Hello, hi, I'm Gail Tarantino, and my piece is a photograph that my father took in um, 1967. Um, it's called Unknown Landscape. I found a collection of his photographs that were unfamiliar to me, apart from the typical auto autobiographical series of photos. And I scanned them and printed them, and then I drew on top um, of the images with acrylic ink that I used a kebab stick that has different um, different whites from very white to more diluted. I kind of wanted to have some association with the landscape and I felt like I was really overthinking it so I just started kind of working in a more fluid way and this is kind of what appeared. It's wonderful. It's just a great community event, and it's just really wonderful to see people come and enjoy themselves. Hello, welcome to the, uh, where are we here? Uh, the the em em Emeryville Celebration for the Arts. And I've had the pleasure of, what, 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 what was your name? Dave. Dave, man. All my friends are named Dave. And Dave and Drew. Who? Drew. Dave and Drew. Okay. Now that we got all the formalities said, uh, this is my, this is my ceramic piece here that I've made for 
I do ceramics. I did the federal building in front of the federal building. It's an 18-foot high ceramic and concrete building. And uh, here we have this. It just, uh, you know, they, they come out of the... I had, I had made some of these tiles in, in New York City when I lived there for a couple of years. And uh, this show is happening here, so this piece popped out, said I want to be in the show and stuff, so. Where, where did you get the different pieces for the... Uh... I make all my tiles myself. I, I made this piece from scratch, from liquid clay, and then I... You know, cut. I, you know, I cut up the clay when it's wet. So, so otherwise, I would be, you know, here a million years. So. so, I wish I could show you the back. You can see, there's some very excellent, excellent parts here. Here's a really good part, and you know, I haven't had time to look at this because I'm one of those people that they always have to do it to the last minute, and it was the last minute, and then so. So what do you think about the celebration of the arts? Well, it's a pretty fabulous thing. I've lived here since it began, which is about 25, 30 years. And, uh, you know, it's nice if you, uh, because I was, when I was here, it was like mud streets and there weren't even streets. And, you know, it's evolved and it's, just, you know, it's kind of not, not, uh, which is a good opening. Uh, my name is Ronald Davis. The name of the piece here is Bobby Hutchison. Bobby Hutchison is a um, jazz vibraphonist, probably, uh, and he's been around for quite some time. He's played with everyone from Miles Davis to McCoy Tyner. Uh, excellent player. And for, for me, in terms of the piece, well, they were actually giving him an award. SF Jazz was giving him an award about two or three years ago, and and I was one of the photographers taking pictures. Uh, and what I, I like to do when I'm taking pictures is, at some point in time when a, an artist is playing, there's always going to be what I call a portrait moment. Uh, so I just try to capture it. So I was fortunate enough, the light hit him right, the expression on the face, and I captured the shot. So uh, what do you think about the celebration here? This is great. You know, I've lived in Emmerville 14 years and have never uh, submitted a piece of art uh, until this year, and fortunately I was selected. The turnout's great, uh, they do a great job, and they've been consistently doing it, which is even better. Uh, the fact that they support artists and give us a platform to show our work, what more can you ask for?